Aubrey. I've been invited to the K Zone Country Club to participate in a golf match for one million dollars. I fly out tomorrow on Eastern Flight number 57 at Miami to K Zone City. It seems old habits never do die. You only live once.
Rock and roll will never die. Rockin' and roll never died. 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 Rockin' and roll. Never died. Rock and roll 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 never died.
Die Freiheit ist unteilbar. Und wenn auch nur einer versklavt ist, dann sind nicht alle frei. Aber wenn der Tag gekommen sein wird, an dem alle die Freiheit haben und ihre Stadt und ihr Land wieder vereint sind, wenn Europa geeint ist und Bestandteil eines friedvollen und zu höchsten Hoffnungen berechtigten Erdteiles, dann können Sie mit Befriedigung von sich sagen, dass die Berliner und diese Stadt Berlin 20 Jahre lang die Front gehalten haben. Education is already an abuse to human rights because if any immigrant is found here, let me say, if he or she is a refugee and he or she is here, it's because he or she is looking for some way to protect his or herself. And deporting the person back to a land where he, his or her life is being threatened 
is already a crime against humanity. And because of this, we have to use any, any means possible to see that we protect anybody who is under the threat of deportation. So the point is that the government knows very well that deportation is an abuse of human rights, and the government goes ahead using all forms of brutality to try to see that these people are deported into places where their lives are threatened. And now we have to come together as well to fight against such brutality. Can you have a campaign against deportation without the immigrants being part of this campaign? Actually, the campaign is coming from the immigrants. We are actually fighting as immigrants because we have got so many weaknesses in other aspects when so many other people come to mess up with people. So what is happening, first of all, we try to build up ourselves, we create networks and we create bases. And the, that's a mobilization from under to see that we come out together and then our supporters can come to give us the push. And that is what is happening. So we are coming together as we are here seated today here. We have all of us, almost all of us here are immigrants. And that is why we are fighting for this right to be recognized. We are not asking anybody to give us the right. We have the right. We need this right to be legalized and recognized. And we are asking anybody who is coming to join us in such a struggle that we need our rights to be recognized and legalized. We stand for total legalization and we stand for a defensive way to fight for our rights and not a defensive way. We don't have to be pushed to the war, but we have to push the government to the war. Thank <laughs> you. 